Today is August 4th. I actually went up to uh, the McHenry Dam. I got all the way up there. I packed the lunch. I packed the cooler. I was going to make a day of it. And I get up there and realize I left my fishing pole at home. <laughs> uh, so, not going to drive up there. It was pretty packed by the time I got there. It was like already 7 30 at night. There was already quite a few people there, so I'm out on some more of my local waters. So using the Lawyers DBC-1, my wind shadow rod. So it's got the chatterbait tied on. Today I'm going to be packing my walls and I'm make a fishing out of it. So I'm basically walking around with this little box of lures. What I have in here is what I'm going to make work. Some chatterbait, some jigs, and a little spoon. See what we could do. Make the best of it. But I did notice that they did have some kayaks. They rented kayaks and canoes up there, so that might be another trip. I'm gonna keep fishing this area here. I really disappointed in myself. Like I get all the way up there had planned on it and I thought I had everything ready and it happens we'll make the best of it so I'm just gonna pond hop and river hop a whole bunch of different spots today I'm not getting in anything I ever had any bites I'm gonna switch to this crappie slab jig on a black with the chartreuse tail Fishing underneath this bridge right here. So let me get this tied on and see if we can get into anything. The water's still a little stained. It's, the water level's going down, but let's get this tied on and see what we can do. Tied on this spoon. I think it's a 1 16th by Johnson. If you can see that. It's a real small spoon. I've actually, I don't even think I've ever, maybe, I don't really use spoons. So I'm going to keep this tied on. My goal today is to actually try to catch something on it. So. Uh, maybe work my way up back to my car and maybe hit another spot. But, like I said, I'm going to keep this spoon tied on, see if we can get into something. A little a bluegill. You know, this is a water inlet. Those are always pretty good. That little, so you can see it. Not a really big bluegill, but it's a fish. There it is. You just hold. They're like fish magnets. That little, I'm assuming this water is a little cooler. But they hold fish. So I'm going to try this area a little. This guy here, to so this spot of fish, I see a lot of bug activity. I came up, I saw some fish. I believe. Look like they were carps. Let's keep it I'm not sure what kind of fish this is. Another bluegill. Nice looking one too. He's off. He's underneath here somewhere. Oh, he's a big one. That's a pretty one too. Get him back in. back to the McKendry Dam. This is what I forgot at home without the, <laughs> that was the whole purpose of the trip. So anyways, had lunch, went to a couple of other spots, but I'm back. I've never been here. Always seen it on my maps. So. That's the dam down there. Just gonna work the top side of this. There's a lot of people fishing right down in here, but let's go and see what we can get into anything. I'm down here by the dam. 
I walked the edge of the river and got my shoes very, very dirty. And I found a trail that actually leads back, so that's what we're on now. But, uh, <laughs> it's hot and sticky and no fish. So I'm gonna try my luck up by the dam. There's quite a few people out there, there's no room. Um, not having any luck. This is the box, <clears throat> the box I'm using. I'm using this Mule Minnow. It's like 1.75 or 2. I um, so we're going to give this a shot. I saw some like small panfish. So maybe this is the ticket. We'll try that. See if we can get into at least one. We need the trip up here. It's probably right a little over a gram. So I'm going to test the reel's capability. I'm going to turn it down just one notch. Alright, let's get back to fishing. Oh, <laughs> I got the biggest fish of the day. At least I didn't get skunked up here. If you can call that a fish or not. <laughs> right today. There's something better than that, then. <laughs> I'm to my finger now. Call it a day. The Kennedy Dam is a bust. I mean, I walked down quite a bit, but uh, just couldn't get anything. The only thing that got me in anything was the Smeal Minnow. But uh, maybe we'll try another spot, but <laughs> it wasn't what I expected. <laughs> 